Woodland Park Zoo in Seattle is helping call attention to the plight of gorillas in the wild. And Cairo 7's Matt Smith has an eye-opening look at these fascinating apes and the major threat to their survival. You know, we talked a little bit about the zoo lately in our shows because I've been running around collecting some really cool original stories for you all. Now, later today, we debut our new episode of our docuseries, Wildlife, A Look Inside Woodland Park Zoo. Now, the first episode is all about growing up gorilla. I want to give you a sneak peek where we explore the critically endangered western lowland gorillas and how you can help change that. We think it's likely that there are probably about 100,000 western lowland gorillas left in the wild. So there is poaching for bushmeat. There is also a lot of habitat, habitat loss where illegal logging is happening. And by doing that illegal log logging, you're taking away their habitat and then you're opening it up for mining. Mining, which oftentimes is done by children. An act that would be deemed criminal in many parts of the world, playing out every day in the Congo. In 2018, this child explained why he does this grueling labor. My parents are dead, this child explains, and I stay with my grandma. He goes on to say that to help his family, he needs to work in these mines. So how do we stop this? This devastating child labor, the destruction of land, and the snuffing out of a critically endangered species before our eyes. And searching for an answer, Miller explains, we need to look in the mirror. And we are all a little responsible for that. In our handheld electronics, there is a mineral called coltan, which gives your phone or its handheld electronic battery life. And that happens to be mined right where the last of the world's gorillas are living. But we don't have to destroy this land. We don't have to mine here. Coltan is valuable, yes, but it can also be recycled phones can be broken down and coltan can be reused thanks to facilities like this one run by EcoCell. That's why the Woodland Park Zoo has teamed up with them. All you have to do is drop off your old cell phone or handheld electronics into these boxes found inside the zoo. Heck, they put one outside for those who don't even want to come in. Heck yeah. It's as simple as dropping off a handheld electronic. It allows you to make a difference. And there's a lot more where that came from. In fact, in our special, we're going to break down why you are much more connected to those gorillas than you may realize. We'll also take you behind the scenes to meet baby Zuna, the new gorilla at the zoo. She is adorable. I guarantee you, you don't want to miss this. And it rolls out today. Beginning at 10 a.m., the all-new episode of Wildlife, a look inside Woodland Park Zoo debuts. Watch it on our Cairo 7 stream or on your smart TV app. Our team is even making it available on demand at cairo7.com slash zoo.